again? Said it again? Look at that. It's getting even all done Sunday if you take me to the airport. Oopsie, Ultra. what happened? Why right that? Up here. That. What is that? It's for Shelly. Oh yeah, what did you get today? A card. Is that an invitation to a birthday party? Yeah, look, it's my balloon. Oh yeah? Look, it's my green balloon. I'll show ya. See, look, it's the same. It is the same. Hmm. Are you excited? Oh, I, I, I got markers. It's okay. I'll go put it so it doesn't get eaten. Okay. Yeah, Saren just got invited to her very first birthday party. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Are you showing me where Kaya's been digging? Look at this monstrous hole that Kaya has dug. It is ginormous. Basically, um, it's Friday, and we are down a car. Uh, if you remember back in February, our new Nissan that we had, one of the solenoids went out, we had to take it to the shop, and we were out of car while they were fixing it. Well, same thing ended up happening yesterday. I took it in today, and they just called me and said, yeah, it's the check valve exhaust initiator valve system timing thingy. So basically what has come and boiled down to is our Nissan is in the shop again to get fixed. We're out of car and we're at that point now where it's just like, all right, really how much more is this car gonna do to us? This is the second time in less than six months that this has happened and it's really annoying. So hopefully they can tell me that they have um, so that they, cause I, it's covered under warranty regardless, so we don't have to pay for it, but it's still the second time that the same issue has happened and it hasn't been resolved. And if this is going to continue the, down the same road, then we don't want the car anymore. I mean, unfortunately, um, in order to be considered in the lemon law in the state of Utah, it has to be the same problem four times and within the 12 months of first 12 months of having the car under warranty and well we just passed that year mark last month so we won't fall into that but we're getting frustrated with it so basically that's what's going on we are missing a car because it is broken Glad it's happened on the Friday where we don't have to go to work on Sunday or Saturday. Bah! Anyways, I am pounding this delicious and amazing salsa that my assistant manager made and it is so, so good. I mean, I eat this thing like it's candy almost. Ah, you're so yummy! And the farmer took a poop. A target on this free dog. Simon, take a peek. He tried to silence Mama. It's like a. Again. You're disgusting. <laughs> That's it. Now? <laughs> you said, Papa, get off. You're big. <laughs> well, your face is still dirty. <laughs> How's it feel to be on the big kid ride? Oh, you're too big. What are we doing today? What are we doing today? This one's going to be all made out of duct tape. It's going to be a super, this is Kelsey's masterpiece of all masterpieces. So hopefully I can get intermittently what she's doing. We were going to set up the tripod, but I don't have the tripod. Oh, I do have, I do have a tripod though.
Sarah, not yet, not yet, not yet. Look at, look out of the way. There you have it. The Colonel in all his glory. And it only took us uh, an hour and a half? An hour and a half. And that looks absolutely fantastic. And we met a lot of awesome people. So you know what? It, the at time was worth the experiences of meeting every single one of you who came and said hi to us. You know, it, it's awesome. We love every single one of you. And we're gonna go get, I'm gonna go get some dinner because I'm hungry. I have not eaten since lunch. And well, there you go, Colonel. What do you have to say? Eat my chicken. Okay, will do. Oh, look, he gave it a black tip. Good job. A black tip. <laughs> Good job. You ready to take the colonel off? This is by far probably the masterpiece of all mas masterpieces of what we've done. All duct tape. And uh, Kelsey did amazing. Good job, Kelsey.